the PC to Windows 10 and the old OBS doesn't work in Windows 10 so I had to get OBS Studios and I have no idea how that works. Like, I... OBS Studio is a mystery to me. Also, that load was longer again. Losing time here compared to my best. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. I, I just felt like... I, I In the beginning, I really said I don't want to kind of stream speedrun anymore. And I even said that when I was playing this game that I just have no interest, but I just got hooked so fast. First day I only played it for like 90 minutes, second day for like 2 hours, but the third day I played it from waking up to going to bed. Ended up playing it for like 10 hours straight, with only a break in between for food. So yeah, and here we are, day number four. I think it's day number four, right? Day number four and I'm so hooked. This game is really good though. That's a hard question because I really enjoyed the first game a lot and I speedrun it for quite a while and this game has only been out for a couple days. So I'm really not sure what to answer. Both are good games. I can say that. This game is more advanced than the first game because they aren't limited to like 8-bit um, style and it quote unquote technically working on NES when it doesn't really. So yeah, this game is more advanced than the first one. Not sure if that makes it necessarily better. But yeah, both games are really good. As you can see, I lost time here. That's probably just because of the longer loading. So it was like a 6 second loading because my best segment was like 8 seconds faster. Yeah, earlier today I had like 15 hours into this game. It's probably like 17, 18 now. Hey, drop down. Hey, HJ. Well, yeah, movement was slow in the first game, but I liked that. In the beginning, I also didn't like it, but I got used to it and eventually appreciated it. Because I prefer faster paced movement as well, myself. But yeah, eventually I got used to it and enjoyed it. Also, thanks for the map. I. I'm thinking about it now. I don't even know why I forgot that that one time. Talk to the guy, please. No, go up there. I really don't want to time each individual orb for now to see which ones are the fastest. So I will just take whatever again. Yeah, last run I was like 44 seconds ahead here. Such a bad run.
I should really put this on my SSD. Yeah, this is the full version. This game came out like four days ago. Hey, grab the ladder, please. Yep, that just happened. I get hit by this guy now. Oops. That guy got stuck inside the block. See if I can get this faster. No, that was so close. There we go. No, no, I need to do it. No, no, no. You know what? Screw this up. I'm getting, I'm getting another one. I'm getting this one here. Yep, key, thanks. I actually remembered now. <laughs> I'm starting to remember stuff that I need to do. I'm learning from my mistakes. But you know what? I'm still getting the bubble. Because I'm up here in order to get the ladder. So I'm still getting the bubble. And since I'm here, I'm getting this orb too. Like, otherwise I would need to go around again. I think it makes sense to get the bubble first. Maybe not, but I need to time that. It just felt like bubble would make more sense when I saw that there is a ladder. Since I think that oh this guy is stuck right I've seen that before like I, I I think this makes sense right just being able to climb up here nope that was a bit too high Yikes. I kind of like the way I do this room. It's not the slowest, but I need to figure out a way to reliably not get hit there. Boss with two hearts, I just like to see getting a third heart. Oh, 
split. That was a bit of a late split, but you know, my splits are messed up anyway. But what I want to do is just in order to make sure to not get hit by that guy, go in there. Smack him, smack him again, and he dropped the heart. That was RNG manipulation, not safety. Just so you know. So yeah, he casts a third time there, even though he's dead. I don't know what's up with that. That always happens when I get this cycle. Hey look, we have accurate splits. I know I can make this jump, but you know, I just want to continue without dying here. Or without having the risk of me being stupid doing a missed jump input or whatever, then dying because of that. That sounds likely to happen today. Easy. Just just smack him and jump over him. And take this hit. I think I would have jumped into that guy, which honestly would have been fine, since I save four here. I think I have seven orbs, so I need to get the one on top of the mage house. I actually had 8 already. No, I did the same thing again. Go back. And that's split. It was a late split as well, but you know, who cares? Still minute and 18 saved. Boss first try, please. No, don't don't cast your stupid block. That's a nice threat. Lightning there. Just need to figure out a good timing for my bubble and then to hit the guy. Hmm. 
Eh, works. Kinda. Nope, not this. Save me! No! Don't cast your bubble when I want to hit him. There we go. That was better. That was much better in, in fact. Yeah. Three and a half minutes, sub sixteen. Oh, really? Oh, that speeds up the fight. I just assumed you couldn't. But I shouldn't assume things, I should just try them. Oh, you are asking. I, uh, yeah. No, I don't think so. Hey, I hit the bell. Oh. Ah, uh, let's use the block then. No. But I fell down here in my PB, so this could be a big time save if I don't fall down now. Which... Ah, that's fine. I wanted to do a block jump over there, but that's fine too. No. I want to be further to the left. Uh, to the right. Cost. Nope. Yep, that was better than my PB. But my PB had a really weird split anyway. I forgot if it was. It must have been too late. I wouldn't split too early. So, yeah, this was an, a late split in my PB as well. I will save time compared to my PB, but not as much as it may show. Someone's at my door. I need to open. Be right back. Well, that was like a minute of time loss. Why would I pause the timer when time is measured in real time anyway? Like, I could pause it, but in the end I would have needed to edit it on top of the time anyway. Uh, this... Oops. 
Going up here. It's not like this will be my forever PB anyway. I got the warp. This is probably where I split the last time as well, because this seems familiar. Still saved a minute, with a late split and me taking a short break. Yikes. I think this split went really well in my PB though. I wonder if it's just faster for this guy to get out of your way. Instead of smacking him three times. Oops. Wow. I hope it doesn't matter. It shouldn't. It shouldn't matter, right? That's not a bubble. Yeah, I activate this here and then I heal. really matters taking damage here. Dungeon is, in terms of taking damage, not the worst in the beginning. It's right there, it's the next thing that heals me. Wait, just activate it please. But yeah, now that I think I know how the zip works with the bubble on ladders, I will probably... probably later today already... mess around with it. See if I can find more applications for it, potentially in this dungeon. Take another one. It's, it's whatever. It really is. But I'd rather not take it. Man, yeah, my splits. Maybe I split even later on the central Alva split because I don't think that was 40 seconds of time lost there. Where would I have lost that? Now 
nice health drop. There's no way I lost 40 on that split. So that gold is definitely inaccurate. I can probably damage boost through that, yeah. I should. This split though, I've died a couple times here in my PB, so it should be time safe. Another heart, nice. Always when you don't need it. And I already avoided the death or deaths. One more death on the way to the next save point. No, 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 no. Not again. Oh, I will take that for now. Just not another one. Nice. Oh. I know why I sometimes can't hit in underwater. I just held diagonal up left, so I, I heard the sound of Alva or Zoe trying to cast a spell and it didn't work. Higher than I expected. Just hit the boss. Don't care how, just just do it. Yeah, this is a nice time save. Close to three minutes. Whatever. I just wanted a health refill because of something like that. This time I know where I need to go and don't go to the left there. I do need that. I could have taken the other one as well. I don't know which one would have been faster, but let's just grab it. Uh, actually, I want a health refill. I don't think I need it, but you know, rather safe than sorry. Oh, derp. Forgot about that one. Like, yeah, this piranha can't hit you. This one could, though.
So yeah, thanks to Chistar. A better strat for this room, which may save time if I get it quick. No, I want to do that from here. Nope. Nope. Yep. Ah, oh, damn. It's definitely better than my strat, though. That was a bad block jump, just. Can I please get a good block jump? That could work. A good block jump. Yep. I think that was still faster than what I was doing last run. Oh, I wanted to slow him down so he's easier to avoid, but that messed up with my expectation. Oh, also, no, I, I will skip that split. I was supposed to split there when I entered. see how quick I get it this time. It was rather quick, my PB. Regardless, I have like 10 minutes, 9 and a half, until I start being behind my PB. Uh. Yep, th that was quick. That was definitely quicker than my PB. Oh, I forgot, I can... I can, in theory, take two hits there. Or do two hits. Oh, that was too low. Alright, oh, he switched his face after three hits, not after four. Don't get hit, please. I just jumped dead on through that block. Safety before I do stupid stuff here again. Yeah, I'm about ten minutes ahead. I have so many deaths on the four mages and a detour that my PB made here on the split. Sub 40 seems so doable. Wait, we took go up here. Oh, 
keep forgetting that I have to burn this. I really need to make a split for this. I don't like long splits usually, so that's why I make more. But I still want to have meaningful splits, not just, hey, I exited this specific room. But yeah, this is a pretty significant item, so a split for that would be fine. Oops. I thought I was on the bubble. I haven't switched apparently. And I think, even if I would have made the screen transition, it would have killed me. Because it would have came with me through the screen transition. Yeah, I deserve to be laughed at for that. Should just do this. Like, it's not even hard. I just wanted to be super safe. Also, I usually jump over this, but being at one health and there being the checkpoint. If I make this fight first try now, I save a lot of time. A lot, I mean a lot. goes much better, 
but I shouldn't say anything. Much better. Yep, perfect fight. Well, perfect in terms of I didn't get hit a single time. I will rechat once I'm done here. Or oh, right now. I will try that, sure. Oh, split by the way. <laughs> Not sure how I avoided that. Mario Land 2 for the Game Boy, which boss would that be? Don't say the piggies. Yeah, it usually started with that attack for me. That's why I want some health going into this fight. Yes, the piggies. Oh, yeah, good thing I had a perfect fight. Just, just hit it, please. <laughs> I almost died there because I didn't do a double hit. So I want full health going into this boss, I see. Hey, is, is this a sub 44 even? With like a minute of time waste because I had to do some stuff for my parents. <laughs> I think this run was pretty good, right? I didn't have any major screw-ups. Hey, thanks for the GG's. Oh no, it's not sub-44. Damn! <laughs> Would have probably been even sub 43. I don't know how long I was gone for. But hey, I'm really happy with this time.